Turning to athletics, Kenya is preparing a strong team for the 2021 Africa Cross Country Championships in Lome, Togo next month. The East African nation recently held a tough national qualifying championship in the capital, Nairobi, that saw a number of new talents emerging from the muddy affair. CGTN's Tuli Shabalala reports. The Nairobi Ngong race course played host to Kenya's 2021 national cross-country championships. At the end of a muddy, physically draining and intense event where giants were slayed, the squad that will represent Kenya at the CAA Africa Cross-Country Championships in Lom Togo was selected. From tens of starters across four races, 36 athletes made the cut for the Africa Cross on the 7th of March. World Marathon champion Ruth Chepngatish, who finished third in the women's senior 10-kilometer race, was among the medalists. She will, however, not be part of those making the trip to Togo. First of all, I want to thank God for giving me the number three position. I am a marathoner, so I was just trying so that I can get speed. So I thank God a lot. This course was tough because of water and lots of mud. The signature race of the day, the senior men 10-kilometer showdown. Witness Rogers Kwemoy upset title holder Kibiwat Kandie by two seconds to become the new champion. He will now headline his country's senior main squad after three-time World Cross title holder Jeffrey Kamwaror and 2015 World Cross silver medalist B. Dan Karoki dropped out of the competition in the second lap. I was 100% and I was ready to be the winner of the day. Yeah, I was in good condition. I'm going for the Africa Cross Country and uh, uh, I'm going to win there. In the mixed relay, world women 5,000 meters champion Helen O'Beary led her team to victory, continuing her rich form into the new year. Obiri will, however, not be heading to Togo as she focuses on the forthcoming international track and field campaign where she is aiming to clinch a first Olympic title in the summer. Next for me, Next for me is going back to the build-up towards the Olympics because the Diamond Leagues are starting in May. I'm targeting to run well during the races. In following its rich tradition, the Kenya National Cross unearthed new blood while acting as a graveyard to the ambitions of heavyweights such as Kamwa Roar and Karoki. This was really good and uh, I'm really, really happy about uh, the organization uh, and you see, when we say cross country, this is uh, a real cross country today because of the rain, the course itself is muddy, you have seen how uh, difficult it was, someone like Camaro did not finish a race uh, because of such, such conditions and there are new athletes also uh, uh, that uh, came out very strongly and it shows that Kenya is, uh, has an abundance of uh, athletes. Athletics Kenya believes the team it selected in Gong will continue the country's dominance at the biannual continental event to lay a solid platform for another glorious year. Tuli Shabalala, CGTN.